What if the guy who figured out how to harness the power of fire had met with the person who invented the wheel? This is the power of knowledge. Despite different time frames, different places, and different ideas. The point? Progress in research and education advances faster when ideas are exchanged. And that's why national research and education networks were built here, and here, and here, and here. Just to name a few places. NRENs flourished around the world. But in some ways, they're just as disparate as these guys. No economy of scale meant high costs and low stability. In short, they can't keep up with the fact that science is global. Education is global. Furthering the concept of a global vision requires more collaboration. It involves more scientific and educational disciplines and more shared resources to fulfill this vision. This is where the benefits of global network architecture come into play. It's a cost-effective and pervasive network. Without GNA, the challenges to research and education teams are vast. For instance, billions of devices can be spread around the planet to collect data. But how do you get that data to a central location? It's bandwidth, time, money. It also requires significant manpower. This data could be critical training or expert insight, like 20 Malawian physicians getting surgical training online. Meanwhile, on the other side of the world, how do you light a fire under people that will benefit from the information being collected? They lack access, speed, and in many cases, Wi-Fi, period. When the NREN of a country is ready to boost their global connectivity, the GNA welcomes them to join. Billions of data points across the globe need to reach billions of people. Before GNA, data was manageable between NRENs, but the world has changed dramatically. The speed and growth required is a thousand times the requirements of just a few years ago. If a single cable broke, connectivity was gone. GNA provides a better way. It's a common language and a common technical architecture. It combines teams from dozens of NRENs worldwide. It reuses existing infrastructure, which equals a better use of funding. But it's only just begun. GNA requires extended reach to fully realize the potential of research and education accessibility for all. The requirement for communication is growing 50% year over year. The wheels are in motion. Key partners are in place, and growth is not only possible, but imminent. GNA globally connects science research and education, but this is impossible without your direct support and resources. Go to gna-re.net for more information today.